Born in a small Belgian fishing village in 1860, James Inzer grew up amidst the odd objects in his family's souvenir and curiosity shop. This unusual environment was crucial to Inzer's artistic development. He spent most of his life in his hometown, painting landscapes, still lifes, portraits, and genre scenes. The deaths of Inzor's father and grandmother in 1887 deeply affected him. Masks and skeletons took on a prominent role in his work. He even added these motifs to previous paintings from the early 1880s. Such imagery evoked both the curious atmosphere of his family shop and the carnival tradition of his hometown, but was also symbolic. While masks masked a reality whose ugliness and cruelty Inzor found unbearable, skeletons revealed the world's vanity and absurdity. The present work, which originated between 1925 and 1930, was previously unknown. Inspired by the photography of the day, it depicts a masquerade whose protagonists include members of the Narroth family, Ernest Rousseau Jr., James Inzor, sporting a military busby, and two unidentified others. It is signature Inzor, showcasing a mother-of-pearl color palette intensified by light, a thirst for modernity, masks that obscure reality, and the artist's self-portrait as a marionette in a masquerade.